Hope your trip is up Taylor. So if you're new here, please do subscribe. Please do leave us a like and comment. I'll be sure to get back to you. Today I'm going to go over this technique. So if I go like this. Okay, which is sun wave to moon wave switch with an added aerial. I have done the sun wave to moon wave switch. So if you haven't checked that out, check it below. I'll link it. But I'm going to go over it all on there. Okay, so what you're going to do, the, the one hand's facing down and one hand's facing up. What you're going to do is you're going to push the hand that's facing down underneath the hand that's facing up, okay, like so. And you're basically going to let go of both sticks. Yeah, please do remember, yes, that the hand that's facing up, yeah, is on top and the hand that's facing down is on the bottom. From there, the hand that's facing down at the bottom, what you're going to do is you're going to rip it underneath the hand on top. And that will be able you to cause to be able to unwrap out of the move. From there, the hand that's facing up, what you're going to do is you're going to throw it in front of the hand that's facing down, which is this one. Okay, now if you notice, both hands are facing down. From there, what you're going to do is you're going to raise these, because the thumbs are underneath the string. You're going to raise both sticks and basically move your fingers to the centre of the rope, okay? That will cause it to be able to fold around your thumbs. Whoosh. You see? From there, what you're going to do is you're basically going to drop these. But at the same time as you drop it, you're going to open these hands like this. Okay, like that. So it'll look like this. And that will allow the nunchuck to pass past your hands and gain height. So well done. You have hopefully have learned this. So, thank you for tuning in. And I'll see you again soon, guys.